If you're a pet person, this was the place you had to be. I was here not to meet humans, but to meet the pets. And the first one I met was an English sheepdog. Tell me a little bit about your dog. What's his name? His name's Bentley. You know, I've always wanted an English sheepdog, but I have one question, and everybody wants to know the answer. How many times do you have to wash this dog? Actually, I brush him a couple times a week. Takes a couple hours each time. And I wash him maybe four times a year. But the big draw of the Pet Expo were the pig racers, and the pig I put my money on was a pig named Jerry Swinefeld. The Super Pet Expo wasn't just about dogs and cats. They had boa constrictors, rabbits. I even ran into a young man who had the most interesting pet on his shoulder. What, what do you have here? Uh, a bearded dragon. What's his name? Allegro. So what exactly does Allegro eat? He eats crickets, mealworms, um, little pellets. Radio reporters? No. You ever wondered how much a 175-pound Mastiff eats a day? He eats close to 3,600 calories a day, so equivalent to 10 cups of food. I've seen hundreds of dogs in all shapes and sizes, but I have to tell you, folks who own Yorkies are in a world of their own. I got to meet Penelope and Madison, and I could tell they were spoiled. Do you always have them in a baby carriage? Not always, but when I come to big events where there are a lot of people and dogs, I think it's safer to put them in a, a it's actually a dog stroller so that they don't get stepped on or injured. But my favorite was two-year-old Dennis the Bloodhound. Dennis is looking for a home. David Bird, WTOP News.